Jackie Calkin has already won $13,000. She is back to try to make it again to the bonus sprint. Today on Scrabble. A six-letter word. The clue is, it comes with strings attached. Sorry! It's the crossword game you've played all your life, but never quite like this. And here's your host, Chuck Woolery. All righty. Thanks, everybody. Thank you, Charlie Schumer, and welcome to Scrabble, the television version of everyone's favorite game. The home viewer word was sent in by Mrs. K.R. Gallagher from Elizabeth City, North Carolina. We have a T-shirt for her. August, this August, is the month of our Scrabble Summer Sweepstakes, and it, lest you forget, every day this month we're giving away great prizes, a bunch of our official Scrabble T-shirts, and Charlie's going to tell us what our winners are going to be getting today. Chuck, today's Summer Sweepstakes winners will receive Excel's Home Gym Fitness System. Includes sit-up bar, workout bar, mat, gyro rope, push-up stand and pillow weights designed to make exercising fun furnished by excel at the end of the month one of our lucky winners will also get an all-expense uh, paid vacation that's to paradise island in the bahamas and that ought to be a lot of fun today the jackpot in our bonus print stands at five thousand dollars finally knocked the old one off winner's going to get a chance that later on in the show charlie's got our first two players and here they are she's our champion he's in public relations from anaheim california jackie calkin and from Rossmore, California, Dave Dickstein. All right, nice to have you both here. How are you, Jackie? Good, thanks. Jackie has $13,000. She won that all in one day. Actually, a half a day. You did real, <laughs> real well. Tell us about yourself, huh? Well, I'm going to be going to medical school in the fall, and I think I'll use some of the money to pay for my expenses and fix up an apartment. And in medical school, I hope to specialize in behavioral and developmental pediatrics. Great. Well, it's nice to have you thanks. back, and good luck to you today. Thank you. Hi, Dave. Hi. Tell me about yourself. Well, I may not be a surgeon someday, but I do have what's considered to be the world's largest collection of business cards. Really? Yeah. Do you have the new Trump card? No, I don't. Ah, no. The new Trump card, you know. I do. sued over that. Oh, I know. That's another... Well, you see, what do you... <laughs> let me tell you, see, this card company in Georgia, I think, have a, they call it their Trump cards, and he's suing them because they're using his name. But they're not. They said, no, it's Trump, you know, like in Bridge, one no Trump. <laughs> I don't think he can get away with this. <sighs> well, we'll all find out. <laughs> Each of our crossword players has uh, one of our home viewers' names in front of them there. The player who wins this game is going to tell us what the, or, well, the winner wins a fitness system, right? And we'll find out who that is out there. All right, you're the challenger, Dave. Let's go to the board. We're playing Scrabble until somebody gets three words right. That player goes on to our Scrabble sprint. They have a chance at that bonus worth 5000 Look at the board. Right. Building on the letter L. Eight letters in the word. The clue is... They often get emotional when it's time to retire. They often get emotional when it's time to retire. Thank you. <laughs> you bet. One and two. Don't forget the pink and blue bonus squares. T and a Y. Why? <sighs> okay, Jackie, over to you. One stopper. Okay, I'll take tile number eight. T or an S? I'll take the S, please. They often get emotional when it's time to retire. And the T? Five hundred dollars. They often get emotional when it's time to retire. Any idea? No, no idea. Okay. I'll take the nine and the seven. O and a D. I'll take the D, please. I think I know it and there's no money. Toddlers. Toddlers often get emotional when it's time to retire. Okay, Dave, building on the letter O and toddlers. Five letters in this word. <coughs> Excuse me. Five letters in this word. The clue is sometimes it came between Lancelot and his lover. Huh. Who was it? His lover was Guinevere, wasn't it? Sorry? Guinevere. Guinevere, right. as in maiden or something. I did a one shot. Queen. Did you do a word? <laughs> Queen Guinevere. I'm sorry. We're going through, leaping through That's history okay. here. It's only my life. Sometimes it came between Lancelot and his lover. And a five. Well, B or a C, Dave? B. I'll see it didn't matter anyway. Okay, Jackie. I'll take tile four. R or a C? I'll take the R. Sometimes it came between Lancelot and his lover. And the C? Stop her. Back to you, Dave. Oh, thank you. Six and seven. It's King Arthur's wife, wasn't it? Yes. He was a little PO'd about that, probably. Very much so. <laughs> It's an old service expression used around the round table. They all knew it. Okay, Dave. Okay, uh, M. 
Sometimes it came between Lancelot and his lover. Wow. Uh, armor. No. Well, <laughs> armor. That's right. Yes. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's one way to get it. Jackie building on the letter A in armor, nine letters in the word. The clue is he's looking to pick something up for nothing. Give you a thousand dollars if you can tell me what it is right now. He's looking to pick something up for nothing. I don't know it. Wish okay. I did. I'll take the eleven and the three. R or a V? V R. It's worth a thousand dollars. Boy, you hit both of them. He's looking to pick something up, uh, pick up something for nothing. I have to take the V. I think I'll take two tiles, the okay. nine and the two. K or an I? The I? No, that's a stopper. Dave, to you. Okay. One. K or a P? My, oh my. Uh, P. Back to you, Jackie. Okay, I'll take the five. K or an S? The K. Hands on your buzzers. Don't answer till I say go. We'll put the letters in place one at a time. Can't give you the last letter. I can't offer this to you, Dave, if you want to try to answer it. Would you like to? Now, if you miss it, if you miss it, you can't play speed word. That's true. So what are you going to do? I will guess it. Okay, he's looking to pick up something for nothing. Scavenger? That's exactly right. No. <laughs> you scared me. I thought, boy, you're going to get into this thing. I've got him into this mess, and he'll never get this right. <laughs> All right, well, you got it. That bell means we're out of time, so we're going to stay in speed word mode. I've already given you instructions. Dave's going for the game. Jackie's trying to tie it up. We're building on the letter E in scavenger, six letters in the word, and the clue is... Some people swear when they get their hands on them. Ready? Ready. Go. Some people swear when they get their hands on them. Jackie. Bible. Absolutely right. No money this time. It's hard to give this stuff away. One, two, three, four, five. Anybody's game. Good luck to both of you. We're building on the letter I in Bibles. Seven letters in this word. The clue is he plays with the Cubs. Ready? Go. He plays with the... Grizzly. Yes. Whoa. Yes. Whoa. That was, that was as good as scavengers almost. It really was. Well, we got a good gift for you, Dave. We're going to give you some luggage, and Charlie's going to tell you about it. Great. Dave, for you, Skyway's newest, Twist Plus, a 26-inch unisex Pullman, offering a new generation of their outdoor twist. New form flex construction resists scrapes, tears, and dirt. Furnished by Skyway Luggage. A unisex Pullman. I have no idea what that is, but good luck to you, hey, Dave. Sir. All right. Open our envelope here and see what we got the fitness system for. That was kind of a nice gift. Yes, for Shirley Robinson from Dayton, Texas. All right, Shirley, you got the fitness system. Your name goes in the pool for the vacation. And Jackie's going to be back with her $14,000 and try for another thousand. Thank you. Thank you.